Hi, big guy. You're a big lazy. Hey, you're starting to disrupt the feng shui that we have, feng shui that we got going on here. Today is a good day for a good day. You're starting to disrupt the feng shui that we have, feng shui that we got going on here. <laughs> Give kitty kisses. Hey, you're disrupting this peacefulness. Yeah, yeah we. No, 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 no. You don't demand breakfast, hmm? You're a good old gal. Look at you, chased away most of the kitties. Get down. Down. Sadie, down. Get down. Yes, I'll feed you. I know I slept in, but I, I worked the night shift last night. What's your excuse? <laughs> no. No. You're feeling very playful today, aren't you? And your mouth is all healed up? Yes, it is. Kate found the foreign object that was in there and pulled it out. Hey, you're really chattery today, aren't you? Stop now. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I'll give you ear massages. There. Okay. <coughs> no. No bark. <coughs> no. Wanna eat? No bark. Were you lonesome? Hmm? When we were at the lake? Here, I'll scratch the back of your your hip bones. You like that right there, don't you? <laughs> You're all set and ready to go. You want the scratches, don't you? What a good boy. This is Coda. Coda usually just lays around and sleeps. But he's actually on the arm of the chair today. So he's doing something a little different. <laughs> For a moment, right? You're going to go back and curl up and sleep, aren't you? Oh, you like that. Yes, oh, good boy. You're so lovable. Yeah, you're just a big cuddle bunny, aren't you? He's all hair. He looks fatter than he really is. He's not, I mean, he's a little overweight, but the vet says he's okay. He's not, like, massively overweight. If he was wet, then you'd see how small he was. He is. We gotta put Christmas away. <laughs> but I can't let go of it. And we're just too busy having fun. Doing things like ice fishing. Putting away the Christmas tree means we have to wrap up everything and put it in boxes. And uh, with uh, various things we've been doing, like traveling for Christmas and going to the lake and ice fishing, is just, there's no time. And I have to go work out now. <laughs> that takes priority. Right, buddy boy? Oh, such a good boy. That's our coda. Oh, yeah. I like the ear scratches. Mm. Oh, yeah. Right behind the ear. And the chin. And the neck. So I had an opportunity at the grocery store to pull a little prank. I was at the store to pick up just a few items, and uh, 
I saw Amanda shopping. So I rolled my card up and I got this on video for you. I rolled my card up quietly behind her and I got my camera ready. And a grocery store manager kind of gave me a look like, why is he videotaping a young woman from behind? And so he looked concerned. So I said hi nervously to him. I wish you could have seen his face because he was like looking at me out of the corner of his eye. And I caught up to Amanda and I kept bumping her with my cart right near her hip and wouldn't let her make the corner. And Amanda's the type that she'll get really annoyed, but she won't say anything until she finally bubbles up. And then she'll be like, look at the person. And that's exactly what she did. She looked right at me with an irritated look. So I had a little laugh at the grocery store while doing this. I'll bring you along. Hi. <laughs> Frank. Were you getting irritated? Yeah. This person kept touching you with their cart. Go. <laughs> I saw you around the corner. I'm like, yes, this is my chance. <laughs> we should get shrimp. Yes, we should get shrimp. It's Christmas time. I'm dog I love shrimp. Oh, you are. You just need oatmeal, peanut butter, and bananas for doggy treats. Really? It was just the chance, because I went to the store to get food for tonight, uh -huh. and then I saw your car out in the parking lot. I'm like, yes, Amanda's in here. I might be able to catch her, but I thought you were going to like sneak up on me first. Oh, really? So then I got my camera all ready, and <laughs> Amanda didn't know I was at the grocery store. We came here separately on our own schedules, not even knowing each other was going to be here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so we'll see you at home. Dog food. Cool. That's a good idea. I'll see you there. All right, time to play with the toy. Keep your eye on the ball. No? Yes? Can you say yes? Yeah? Yeah? You should say no. No. Say yes? Uh-huh. Yeah. 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 Can you catch it? <laughs> Sit up. Ooh. Sit up. Too slow. Whoop. <laughs> whoop, whoop, whoop. <laughs> Are you looking confused? Where's your toy? <laughs> You're going to get dizzy. Where's your toy? Whoop. Ow. He hooked my finger. Oh, you got a good boy, good boy. <laughs> good catch there, Mason. Whoop. You're fast. Whoop, whoop. Not fast enough. Round and round it goes, where it stops, nobody knows. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> you don't like not catching it, huh? <laughs> Poor Mason. There, now you got it. Oh, <laughs> there it is. Is it on your head? You got feathers on your head. Oh, there he is. Well, Mr. Coho caught it, and he's going to take it away from me. Bye, Cole. <laughs> All gone. You got feathers in your mouth?
my toy. <laughs> no, come back here. Got my toy. Ah. No, give me that back. Give me my toy. <laughs> no, give me my toy. No, give me my toy. I want my toy back. <laughs> well, mine. Good jump. Whoop. Yeah. Whoop, whoop, whoop. <laughs> Whoa, up you go. Whoa, down you go, and you got it. <laughs> Give me my toy. One of the beauties of living up north is the fact that after working a 12 hour night shift you gotta scrape your windows so frost which is my last name frost has appeared on my window so you can make lots of jokes saying yep sure looks like jack frost everyone asked me that are you related to jack frost the guy that paints the patterns on your window and I always look at them and say, well, no, that's actually my nephew. And then they, they feel dumb because I actually have a relative named Jack Frost. And the fact is I don't. <laughs> so the joke's on them. Everyone thinks they're funny talking about Jack Frost. And you must be related to Jack Frost. Uh, I always say, yep, I am. That's my nephew. Doesn't that look like fun? Doesn't that sound cold? heater doesn't quite catch on, although it looks like an eyeball from cars. Frost is pretty though, when you look at it through the right light. It's kind of like life. It can be beautiful looking through the right light. Did you two miss each other? Yes, you're a couple of snugglers. Yes, you are. I'm keeping each other warm. Did you miss your Mason? Huh, Coda? Did you miss your Mason? Mm, oh, yeah. Scratches for two kitties. Today is a good day to 